So this is the first iteration of our new series um, spun off the Go Fast Northeast Instagram. Um, something we want to kind of try and build the whole idea around. Um, we're going to start doing this podcast. Uh, we alluded, it, alluded to it a few times in Instagram stories and whatnot. Um, hopefully by the time you're seeing this, it's gotten a little bit more press on the Instagram account. But anyways, we just want to touch on a few basic points. I'm here with Cal and Wesley. Um, going to be taking us away here today. Um Anyways, broad strokes is we really want to grow a vibrant, you know, powerboat community on Long Island and in the northeastern United States. Obviously, um, you know, Florida has a super huge powerboat community and, uh, you know, they've got FPC, really cool group. Um, Been watching those videos for years, love everything they do. And, you know, we do have National Powerboat Association in New York, but um, I feel like there's a, you know, there's a whole community out towards the eastern part of Long Island and in Connecticut and really just the tri-state area and then even into, you know, Rhode Island, Massachusetts. We've gotten so many, so many boat submissions, um, as you can see on Instagram, and we really just want to, you know, sit down and talk about power boats, talk about the lifestyle, talk about nonsense, you know, just have a good time and uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully you guys will like it and hopefully, uh, hopefully it grows into a vibrant community and we can start really uh, promoting our poker run or fun run that we hope to grow into a poker run. Um, you know, uh, just to touch on that quickly, we have the August 27th poker run, fun, fun run, sorry. Um, we did that this year, and on super, super short notice, um, barely even a month, um, Joe Polio, very grateful to him. He helped us set up a bunch of things, give, gave us a bunch of great ideas, and then, um, you know, we had a couple boats register for that. Obviously, it was a very short notice thing. Um, but, you know, we had some guys come out of Connecticut. Um, one Top Gun and I believe it was a 39 cigarette center console. I could be wrong about that. Um, anyways, had a blast doing that. Um, got to meet up with some cool people at Claudio's. And, um, yeah, that's kind of what this whole thing is going to be about. Um Obviously, there are going to be some more funny episodes where we kind of just <laughs> dive into what our lifestyles are like. But, um, you know, we definitely want to focus on growing the Powerboat community, growing that lifestyle out here, and growing the fun run into a poker run. Um, yeah. Yeah, so, um, you know, we, we started off with this fun run, and it was... You know, it wasn't a lot, but it was definitely fun, and um, I hope everybody who attended felt like they had a good time, and I know uh, we really appreciate those people showing up, and um, Cal was actually out there taking pictures for us, um, got some really great shots, and uh, Cal, why don't you just take us through, you know, the, the whole rundown the, of the, the, the day, fun. man, yeah. So, I guess kind of leading up to the fun run, I, when did, when was this kind of, like, publicized that there was going to be a fun run? Um, two months before, right? Two, it was like, yeah, it was short like, notice, It right? was literally the end of July, I think. It was, like, July 20th. I started really And it was, like, August it. 23rd, August 24th, yeah. right? These guys came out of the Woodward. It was the 27th, us, yeah. August 27th. The 20th, yeah. So, so, yeah, the 27th of August is when the fun run actually happened, and... There was a there was actually a pretty good turnout of people for uh, such short notice. We we basically um, we docked up from Claudio's, which is kind of like a powerboat bar um, in Greenport, close to us. If you boat on Long Island Sound, you're part of Claudio's. Yeah. Claudio's, and uh, from there we kind of just ran around, and and uh, I was able to get some good shots of uh, the Sig and and everybody on it having a good time and. For me, it was kind of one of those things where 
I showed up and there was like this crazy turnout of boats just kind of like locking up the docks of Claudio. Some of the craziest boats that I had ever seen. And, and I'm not really accustomed to the whole culture of, of power <laughs> boating. So for me, it was it was pretty wild. I think for everybody else, it might have been, you know, a little bit more on their level. But I was absolutely blown away by the turnout. I mean, there was I don't even know what these boats were. They were beautiful, though. I mean, there you was, know, I hate to say it, but, I, you know, honestly, a lot of those people and this is a huge part of what we're trying to do here is. A lot of those people weren't even with us because they just hadn't heard about it. So that's mm-hmm. a huge part of what we're trying to kind of remedy for next year. But um, definitely a lot of cool boats were there. And, you know, a couple of them were we were fortunate enough to have them run around with us. Yeah. Yeah, no, it was definitely uh, definitely an awesome time. And uh, it's, it's something that we look forward to again next year. We hope to have an even better turnout. And so that's sort of the, the goal of Go Fast Northeast is to, to bring together a community of of power boaters and people who are within this realm that we're in to uh to kind of just group up and be able to meet up and and uh just get together and have a good time and it doesn't even necessarily matter what boat you have really it's just kind of just the community behind it and within the northeastern area absolutely the 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 scene i feel and and you can correct me if i'm wrong isn't as large as what i've noticed to be from down south right yeah i think it you know it it has a really big a big portion of that is really just i don't think there's a lot of um you know i hate to say it but we're you know we're in the 21st century here it's 2022 and you know a lot of this stuff is based off of online content um you know in florida you have like I said before, FPC, and they do a really good job of getting this content out there, and not definitely not to knock anybody like uh, National Power Boat Association. You know, they have their fun run, and they do a really good job of uniting the power boat community, no doubt. Um, but you know, we're hoping to kind of regionalize it a little bit more, and definitely, um, you know, if there's anything we can do to help those guys mm-hmm. and support those guys absolutely but um you know we definitely want to start our own thing because you know we just we really love this community and everybody that we've met i mean i know you've met some people from the community this summer um some really great people and you know everybody's just so you know they want they want to have fun on their boats and they want to enjoy these awesome toys that we have and you know, if that's something that we can make happen a little bit more often and in a whole new neck of the woods. Yeah, I think I think a big part of it, too, is that in the Northeast, from what I've noticed, there's not as much of a media followed behind the powerboat yeah. scene. And there's not many people that are occupying that space. And that's sort of a goal of Go Fast Northeast, whether it's a like, a follow, a subscription, purchasing merch any little bit of that to support kind of what we're trying to gain in this area of the country uh, definitely goes and it speaks volumes for what we're trying to do, which is just to build a community within the Northeast of, uh, of power boaters pretty much. Yeah, definitely. I mean, well, I could say throughout what I've seen, I mean, I was kind of hesitant on, you know, Dan, I could, you know, it's horrible. I'm sorry to say so, but I was hesitant on, you know, you know, Dan and Cal and, our other boys saying that they were going to start this fun run and and uh, trying to get people to go, and I was kind of like, you know, a skeptic on seeing how many people were going to show up. But I mean, the most videos I've ever seen of power boats run, you know, all over inlet on Instagram, yeah. seeing these guys running, you know, these waves and all the, you know, seeing all this crazy stuff. But you know, the the amount of people that that ended up pulling through was insane. Yeah, I mean, it was it. I wasn't able to make it, but I mean, yeah, it was it for the notice that for the notice that was given, yeah. it was definitely a great turnout. I think for the first, for I mean, how many months had Go Fast Northeast even been been completed? Three since months, maybe three the, months yeah. in. So, so it was like I mean, a month really, after. I mean, yeah, you really can't expect much more. And you had that months. much, to, you know, with the Instagram yeah, and the absolutely. website. We I started. Mean, we started Go Fast Northeast. We started the Instagram. No website. No nothing else. We started. Go we started Fast a couple Northeast. weeks after you got the boat. June. 10th, I believe, yeah. was yeah. June 10th. It took and off. By August 27th, yep. you know, we had a following of, I think it was, well, you, if you not told a thousand, me. it was over, it, I think it was like 1,200 almost. It and might it might have been a little less, but. Which is, is that how many followers yeah. you guys got now on Instagram? How many followers you guys got We're up to like 1,500 and <laughs> change. 
couldn't believe that. Which, I remember. Yeah, I, mean, I remember how excited you were when you told me that you guys got two hundred in like two yeah. weeks. Yeah, and I mean that was know, awesome. It just it really does speak to how many people are exactly. in this area that there just isn't a huge represent representation on the you know. Yeah, you wouldn't think it. Yeah. Community. On, on the community yeah. scale where it's not just, you know, one particular state or one particular town or one particular run. It's not a, you know, there's no representation of everybody there. Yeah. People who maybe don't want to make the trip to, you know, National Power Boats, Boats Association, their run. But even yeah. though, I mean, even though you had, even though we're in such a small place and we're kind of far away, you still had people coming out from Connecticut yeah. to come for the fun run, people coming out to yeah. talk to and us, and Claudio's, yeah. I mean, like, like Which it was it, crazy. It speaks for itself, obviously. Obviously, there, we're doing something. And, and, that's, yeah. and that's why we're doing what we're yeah, doing, yeah. is yeah. because there's obviously people who, who are kind of like yearning somewhat for that that we're not just representation doing it for, of, yeah. of yeah. what it not is. Not just doing it for us, we're doing it for everybody else. Exactly. Yeah. I mean we're having a I mean, great time. For us. Well, yeah, <laughs> but I mean we're having a great time, but everybody else is having a blast. I yeah. mean it's like And it's cool to be a part of something like that. I think. Yeah. For a lot absolutely. of people I think it's really cool to be a part of something yeah, like since that. We, well since we you know you know not we but I mean since you guys have started something that's so that's grown to I mean, from what I was said, from something so small to so big, I mean, obviously people are taking interest to the community that we, you have grown. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's insane. The people that we meet, even at bars, that, you know, to going out and people saying, hey, you know what, I got kind of a boat, you know, powerboat kind of like that, and, you know, mm -hmm. I'd like to join to do something like that. It's yeah, crazy. Yeah, we small. Yeah. We live in such a small place, and we That's, meet people that come from all over. It's exactly like I said before. I mean, you don't have to have a cigarette boat. Or, you know, I don't even, you, you uh, found yeah, a yeah, formula. But yeah, you, you, don't, you, you don't, don't have to have yeah. some strategy. But yeah, yeah. You don't have to have a million really, dollars to start yeah. something that's so great. It's it doesn't, really it doesn't more matter. so about a, yeah. a, a, a respectable community, yeah. community and something that's concrete, something that's established for people to be able to partake in that, oh, definitely. that we're, yeah. we're after. And that's yeah. that's the goal for Go yeah. Fast Northeast, I think, for everybody. And people, you know, people, some people follow us and some people look at, you know, some personal stuff, you know, some personal Instagram stuff. You know, we just we've done some crazy stuff. Yeah, some good. You know, we do. We got some good stuff on the old Instagram. And, you know, that's uh, that's definitely that, definitely going to be a, comes, that that comes, part. Yeah, that comes, yeah. yeah that you'll comes, see that. Don't yeah, worry. Yeah, don't. It, that is definitely going to be a huge part of this. Is of course. Um, I think that comes with it. I think a lot of the people that that. You can't tell me that you what don't. What we yeah. do are, are yeah. somewhat partaking yeah. in. You can't tell me you activities. don't own a cigarette boat. And you don't have as much fun as we do. If you if you own a cigarette boat, and you don't have as much fun as we do. You're, you're doing, doing something, something wrong. wrong. You're doing something <laughs> wrong. Get rid of your boat. We are having fun. No, don't get rid of it. Just don't get no, rid of it. No, don't get rid of your boat. I'm just saying. <laughs> we, we, we love all walks of life. We love yeah, all, yeah. Okay. Yeah, party I'm sorry. Hey, if you're, ma if you're married with you kids, do. we understand. Yeah, get us on a console. But I'm just saying, don't get rid of your cigarette. 25 years <laughs> old. And <laughs> yeah. Everybody should buy a cigarette boat. Uh, you know, everybody should go. At least you try to experience it. Start with the center console and then go right from center console to cigarette boat. But hey, you know. It's great. Cigarette? Statement, outer elements. They're making some really cool center six, consoles. Some sick center consoles right now. And that I is mean, true. We yeah, were, that is true. We had um, you guys I had that I center console before, on the run. It was a I, I don't know if it was a thirty two or thirty nine, but we had a uh, a cigarette center console out. And my God, what a cool boat! Was it the black and orange one, or was it? No, it was uh, if I can remember correctly, it was blue and it had a tan interior. Um, Anthony. Gar Garibaldi if you know who you are and you're yeah. watching this right now, drop a comment. Yeah, we'll definitely. Shout definitely you out yeah. Dan likes your boat. Yeah, yeah, I know. We sent you some. We yeah. sent you a T-shirt, and I hope you liked it. But, <laughs> we uh, want to race. No, that, that, no <laughs> we definitely <laughs> don't want to race. But that was a badass boat. And, Not now. Um, Catch us next summer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna do some yeah. motor. I don't know. Motor motor I don't know. Next summer. Yeah, yeah I gotta put new motors in. No. Um. You know, those were some of the people who first came out to the fun run, and. <clears throat> really grateful, really grateful for the people who showed up, and even the people who registered, regardless of whether or not you made it, you know, just that support, and knowing that there are people who are interested in that type of thing, you know, it pushed us to where we are right now, and yeah, it pushed definitely. us to keep going, and I, I think that's really what people have... At least from what I've been seeing, that's what people want, and uh, we yeah. tend to yeah. give it to them. <laughs> I feel like the fun run was really kind of like a true testament to continue doing this, too. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. 
before I think it was more or less just kind of like I don't, don't want to speak down on it like it was just an Instagram page where we were featuring yeah, boats let's, and things let's like share, that. Let's share the pictures but of our boats. As soon as the fun run happened, it became real, I feel like, yeah. because and it's only it's only really going to showing up for this and they yeah, really yeah. are liking what we're doing and so that kind of just it's only going to go up from here though you yeah know? yeah it really just gave everybody a kick in the ass to kind of be kicking into high gear and, and we, like, we right, definitely want to do is, something we yeah. have definitely want to do the fun run they do from manhattan right yes and through all I, that I, you know i can't awesome. i can't apologize yeah. enough to awesome. mpba for not making that this year we really want that would to been awesome um just with work and some issues we had with the boat just wasn't in the cards for us um, but definitely super cool thing that they're doing, and we really hope to collaborate with them more um, in the future in, you know, whatever way they see fit. Yeah, they do a beautiful run. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the <laughs> photos, the content we've seen out of there, just so cool, so cool. Yeah. Can't, can't say enough good things. Um, and, you know, while we're on the subject of other people, I would, and especially the fun run, I would definitely like to shout out um, Joe Polio. Uh, he runs Zap Hoboken. It's a fitness thing. Jim, look them up on Instagram. As awesome well guys, as um, yeah. his other company, USA Wheels. Um, just so instrumental, so helpful setting up the fun run. Um, really helped us out. Really just, I was bouncing ideas off of him, talking to him, you know, once, twice a week. And, you know, just really pushed us through the idea phase into okay we're actually going to do this and i'm really super thankful to him and you know if you guys need wheels fixed definitely go check out usa wheels on instagram they do a they do a good job yeah definitely helped it helped you skyrocket the mindset yeah, yeah definitely no absolutely yeah. um and you know there there are definitely a bunch of other people who have helped us and we're going to talk about all of them um in coming episodes and yeah, I mean, yeah. definitely, you know, stick with us. This is gonna yeah, be a, this is gonna be a crazy yeah. journey. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 we got, we got, just, we got just, a lot yeah. of stories. Yeah. yeah, it's gonna be. We got we no, got some we got some good some good stuff. Some fixing, yeah. some some breaking, there's, some solving. Yeah, we got some lot. good yeah. stuff. Kind of to touch on what did, like there, there's a lot of different content that we <laughs> yeah. really do have. Yeah, in one summer of Surrounding running, this summer we have some stuff that'll blow your mind. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's it's amazing. Yeah, I mean, shit that'll make you go, what the. Yeah. Whether you know. whether you you are are an avid, you know, avid proponent of the boats themselves, or just kind of like the lifestyle behind it, yeah. there's really content on all ends of it, and For there sure. is more than enough that we have that we're 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 really looking forward yeah. to. Creating and, and you don't. I mean, you don't have to really. be a cigarette boat guy to, to listen to yeah, what we do. You can own a frig, really, you yeah. can own a frig attempt, You know, whatever. You can own a five foot dinghy. Who cares? <laughs> if you want to hear some, yeah. you know, some some and great we're, stories. And we're going to be we're going to be dropping another uh, podcast. I don't know if I'll be I'll be in on it because I'm not really a boat owner, but. The previous boats that all of these guys have owned, I mean, they weren't cigarette boats. So for anybody out there that's like, yeah. man, I, I, I either can't afford a cigarette boat or I just don't really want a cigarette boat. Yeah, if you if you we're like yeah, yeah, yes. we're not, yeah, it we're really doesn't make a difference what kind if you of like yeah. it's like a lifestyle, really. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We are, you know, we've had them all. We're yeah. definitely we here to talk about them all. Anything. We've definitely, yeah. Yeah. and, you know, it just because just because we say cigarette boat, you know, definitely yeah. doesn't mean that we don't respect other boats. I mean, some of the most beautiful boats we've had on the page, we've had two gorgeous fountains featured. Um, yeah, definitely. Uh, go check them out on Instagram. Just absolutely gorgeous boats. Fast boats. Faster than us. Yeah. No <laughs> doubt. Uh, but, hey, meet us at a four-foot chop. We'll see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you don't have to be. You don't have to be. You don't have to be a cigarette boner. Boater to, I just said cigarette boner. Did you hear that? Yeah. Actually, you, don't have to be a cigarette, you don't have to be a cigarette boater to see what we do. Yeah. And to know. listen to the stories, because like I said, like he said, it, we didn't start off with a cigarette boat. I mean, we're talking about eight, nine boats. Put a lot of boats. Yeah, maybe more. And just to, know, just to test the and, water. And that, and, that, and that will be in a separate. Yeah. Oh God. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. It really, you really do have to kind of just like title a whole. Yeah. And I really podcast. hate to say it, but it's taking too much time. That is not a bragging point. No, we've had no, eight not. or nine boats <laughs> yeah. that it's have lasted hard. one season. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Multiple have sunk. Yeah, yeah. yeah we some saw, of them yeah. have sunk. Some of them have had just. 
10 different motors thrown at <laughs> yeah. uh, So many great stories, and it's amazing. really hope you guys are with us, you know, yeah. in the future, because we really want to share all these stories with you. Definitely. And even if you're not, you know, like they were saying, even if you're yeah. not a boat owner and you're just here for the lifestyle, we appreciate you, and, mm-hmm. you know... Cal will teach you how to live. I'll teach you how to run a boat, and Wesley will teach you how to be funny. Yeah, that's and it. if you're all three, good for you. Stick around; you might enjoy something. But yeah, I mean, all I can say is uh, we really want to grow this brand, and we appreciate all of yeah. the following, and you know anybody, yeah. anybody yeah. that's really, uh, really yeah. getting down with Go Fast yeah. Northeast. So this, really is go fast northeast. Yeah. Yeah. this is Go this Fast is Northeast. This is Go Fast Northeast, and then we hope to see you next time. Thank yeah. you very much.